Hey poison lovers, Annie here in my natural habitat and I just want to remind you that sharing is caring and it's also the prescription for keeping the show rolling so if you like any of our videos please do share them on Twitter or Facebook or anywhere else on the internet you have friends. So thank you and let the killing spree commence. <laughs> Welcome to Pick Your Poison. Today we're talking about the Polish joke of the poison world, polonium. How do you stop a Polish army on horseback? You shut off the carousel. And then shut your mouth, you jerk, because being Polish is not funny and neither is polonium. Polonium was discovered in 1898 by Marie Curie, who named it after her home country of Poland. And yes, naming one of the world's deadliest poisons after your own home country is kind of in itself a Polish joke, but in her defense, she named it polonium to publicize her country's lack of independence. And at the time, she didn't know how poisonous it was. Again, not that helpful for those Polish stereotypes. Polonium is an extremely radioactive silver gray metallic element. It's mainly used as a static elimination device in factories and has been used on moon rovers to keep their internal components warm during those cold lunar nights, which I think is the name of a Van Morrison song. There are very low traces of it on the Earth's surface, but it's usually created as a byproduct of uranium enrichment. So polonium is in very limited and highly regulated supply. Only about 100 grams are produced every year, and all of that is tracked by governments and international coalitions, so you're not getting your hands on any of it. But just so you'll die, let's say a piece of polonium smaller than a grain of table salt did find its way into your bloodstream. Hooray! Symptoms include nausea, hair loss, throat swelling, and pallor, which basically means you'll look terrible. And then comes DNA damage, cell death, organ failure, and death death. So you were poisoned by polonium and now you're dead, which is actually a pretty rare thing. Experts believe that only three people have ever died from polonium poisoning. Russian dissident Alexander Litvinenko, Palestinian leader Yasser Arafat, and Marie Curie's daughter, Irene Joliot-Curie. Those first two were most likely assassinated, and the third one is just another example of how these damn Polish jokes just keep writing themselves. You were most likely killed by the secret service of an angry uranium-enriching government. They probably snuck some polonium into your food. Secret services hate getting caught poisoning people, and ingestion is the least intrusive way to get polonium into your system. Polonium cannot pass through skin, so if they tried throwing it on you, you're fine. Just hit the showers and get yourself into a witness protection program now. Maybe go hide out in the Amish country for a while. They never enrich uranium, I don't think. If you don't think you're worth the trouble of having a country send an assassin after you, first get some self-esteem and then maybe try death by baby powder. Yes, that's a real thing that happens and the country that does it to you is your own mom. Don't forget to subscribe and comment below. And if you're one of the beautiful, wonderful people who don't think this show is getting enough views, please subscribe and send this episode to your friends.